Howdy, y'all. I think I got this started. Uh, it's the second time I've started because the first time I forgot to put the microphone on. I forgot to even turn the microphone on, so I was like, hey, hold on. Then I had to switch everything around. I haven't even started the chemo yet again, and I got chemo hit again. <laughs> Anyways, uh, I'm going to talk in a minute, but uh, they're uh, uh, one of the, a new Skinner song. I, I, I'm, I think I'm just going to give it up, man, and I, maybe I'm just going to devote myself to learning all Every single guitar part by every single play, picker who ever played for Skinner, starting with the, the original three there. And um, maybe I'll do that. I don't know. But uh, um, I Never Dream came into my head last night. I don't know why. But uh, and it's like, well, that's kind of cool. But how the heck do you play? And then I looked at the chords. And I'm like, what, 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 what? But after a little bit of weirdness, it's like... So all that is is a B flat. This had to be Rossington. Had to be. And, and then you pull off on the on the root and then a C and same thing and then an F and then walk it up, man. And then a minor, my D minor. And then, as far as I can figure, then the next one goes D minor, and then A minor. So, Anyways, and then there's a, the whole song is pretty much just variations on all that. If you can, if you can get that down a little bit, then you can listen to the rest of it and be like, oh yeah, because then he just goes backwards. And different things all along there on that but it's it said sorry and it's just super cool and uh so yeah if you could like comment subscribe I'll get that in before I start ranting and raving. Uh, if you could like, comment, subscri send, subscribe. I would like to give away a guitar, but I would like to get to a thousand subscribers first. So if you could hit that subscribe button, you don't have to watch. Just hit the subscribe button. Um, that would be awesome. Um, and then I just, I, I really wanted to, I have been saying since I started this channel that I was going to, at some point in time, rail against the medical industry and I haven't and I, I didn't know why because it's like in, in me and the anger I guess it's not even anger it's um frustration mostly is it's they, they hadn't been I guess serving me I don't even know if that's the word I'm looking for but uh they hadn't been listening for sure um and I kept telling them things and they're like nah 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 and it's, it just seemed like the, the rest of my life you know it's like nobody listens to me and and um, they finally started listening. And it's in a backhanded way, but at least they're listening now. So it's like, you know, the chemotherapy, I had the question all along. Since they since they, they finished the chemo in the first time, I went, hey, wait a minute. It looks like it's gone. What the? And then, you know, ever since then, all they've been doing is, well, but, but and, you know, and it's, it's now they're it's growing. Uh, and now they want to do surgery, totally want to do surgery again. But. My whole thing had been, why can't we try the chemo and radiation again? You got it once. So to me, it's like, get rid of it. Now what we have to do is find a way to, way to keep it gone. So you can get rid of it. What we need to do is work on a way to 
keep it gone. Don't think they were thinking that way, and they're still not, but it's a start. Like I said, this is actually getting me the result that I was looking for in the first place. So I can't really go, you know, oh my God, my, my, my. I mean, I can because it's going to suck, but you know, it, it's also, it's the, it's going to suck, but I can now build myself up to it. I know what I'm getting into this time. I can actually try and help this time instead of going, I have no idea what's happening to me. I don't know what's going on. I'm just trying to survive. You know, now I know what's happening. Now I know what I need to do. I know what my focus needs to be. And my focus needs definitely to be to survive. But instead of going microwave something that's bad for me, I will make sure to have things that are good for me. Um, and, and I will make sure that I will try to exercise. And now that I know that the neuropathy could be coming, like I told my oncologist, she looked at me and she was like, you know, I want to try and mitigate. I'm like, I will take one of the things that helped me was playing the guitar. I will start taking it to bed with me. And uh, it's like, you know, uh, that's my determination level. I'm going to keep that out of there. So I also have to keep the feet part out of there too. So I got to do more with that. I got to get my ass over, see if the elliptical machine will work for me. You know, I got to do that. The stuff that I've been talking about and all that other stuff. The biggest thing that I was happy about was the neurology thing. And I don't know why I'm happy to be crazy, to be, have it, have them say, oh my God, there, there might actually be something that went wrong inside your brain not wrong but you know that changed inside your brain because their word was brain shift and i'm like oh my god yes so that is the biggest thing it's like you guys are smart why can't you get this and finally it was like between the counselor and then my doctor she, it's like you know the just looking at them is like oh 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 so it's like, you know, that just that in itself was kind of worth the price of admission because they are finally getting it. <sighs> wow. So it's like, you know, this is a big release for me in the first place because it's like, oh my God, thank you so much. You're finally getting it. And that also is going to help me because me pounding my head up against the wall saying, you know, this is happening to me. And I'm going, yeah, uh -huh. yeah, it's happening. Uh -huh. Sure. Mm -hmm. Now they're saying, oh, it's happening. And it's like, oh, thank you, God. You know, so it's like I, I can leave that part of the fight because they're finally getting it and finally doing something about it. Now I can concentrate more on fixing the thing that's down there that I need gone. And we're going to get it gone because, yeah, man, I can focus that energy now on that as well. So. Yes, this this next little time until they start until they start me on this chemo is going to be all about preparing, getting mentally prepared, getting stronger mentally, getting all everything that that I need to get in there, um, and and thanking God because God is hooking me up, dude. Because this has all been the long game, and I just didn't realize it. And I've been praying for this stuff, and it's working. And thank you, God, thank you. So um, I will never. Reject anyone's prayers. Please keep them coming. You guys are amazing. Um, I'd like to also grow this channel for that reason, because of the energy, because you guys are amazing. And because with that energy, even just a little bit from you guys, just a little bit from each one of you guys, um, I, I I feel it, man. I, I'm getting stronger. And thank you. So that also helps me a lot. And this has been a really long video for some reason it's because it's also a release and you guys really do help me and for whoever makes it to the end of this you guys are totally helping me the most because you guys are just you know you're sticking with me and giving me that power man and thank you thank you so much for being humans and thank you for trying to help another human just but yes just by your prayers and thank you and the thoughts that you're giving me and that I can you you guys see things in me that sometimes I don't that I am strong and I don't see that I, I see I'm fighting but that's what I see that I don't see the strong part I see that I, I can fight and I can see that you can knock me back down again and I am that Jersey strong man I will get back up and then the rest of the world can can keep their cliches and all that. I don't give a crap because it might look to you like we're just stupid and we just keep getting back up. There's more than that. There is more, way more than that in there. Way more. 
anyway, like I said, this was about, it started with that cool riff, man, and, and please, Skinner fans, you know, go out and learn more, man, because it's so amazing. <laughs> Screwing it up. So, anyways, always look up. He's there for you. I have to wow log back in. That is crazy again. And I hate when that happens because this video should have been over and now all I'm doing is babbling incoherently. <sighs> Anyways, always look up. He's there for you. If you made it this far, thank you. Peace.